everybody, this is Anzac, and in this video I'll be showing you how to install infantry over a fresh copy of Running With Rifles, how to install the high resolution texture package, how to uninstall the mod and revert back to a backup copy of Running With Rifles, and how to obtain the latest version of Running With Rifles, just in case a new patch came out and that, that makes your previous version and backup obsolete. Okay, so let's uh, get started. Now, I highly recommend that infantry be installed over a fresh copy of Running With Rifles. Now, I'll begin to show you how to do that. So, go to Steam. Go to your Steam library. And we've got Running With Rifles here. Just right-click. Go to Properties. Now, in here, we've got our local files. So, just go here. Browse Local Files. And straight away, we're inside the root directory of Running With Rifles. Now, here, you'll see a folder called Media. Just rename this folder. rename it to backup okay so now uh, steam will no longer read this folder this according to steam this folder is invisible now right, so let's go back to steam back into the properties of uh, steam library and then you hit verify integrity of game files All right so just hit that and then it will steam will scan your running with rifles root directory it will find that a certain number of files are not valid. Uh, that's the entire media folder. Steam thinks that the media folder is missing. It will re-download the media folder from its latest uh, copy of files in the Steam library. Put that onto your hard drive and then you're ready to go, ready to launch uh, the game. Now I'm going to uh, simulate that that process. I'm going to simulate that uh, what Steam will do. Okay, so this is a fresh copy of uh, Running With Rifles. So it's unmodified. So Steam would be uh, re-downloading the media folder, so I'm just going to simulate this now. Okay, so that's how your folder will look like after Steam is done with it. Right, so now that that's done and you've got a fresh copy of Running With Rifles, uh, you download the mod. Okay, and once you've got that download, uh, you will need, I highly recommend to use the 7-zip archive utility. As you can see, all my files are archived using 7-zip. 7-zip uh, is a great open source archive utility and the compression ratio is actually higher than WinZip and WinRAR. It's a very good uh, utility. I've been using it quite a lot uh, for quite some time now. It's a great program. Uh, the download, you'll find it at 7zip.org. So just type in 7zip in, in Google. Uh, download 7zip. You see it here. Uh, it's the beta. This is the full version here. So you just go down here, download. 64-bit 7-zip for 64-bit Windows. All right, once it's downloaded, just install it, and then you've got 7-zip in your drop-down menu. Okay, so we just uh, do Open Archive, do Extract. Now, in this window, we need the root directory of the game. That's here. Okay, so you'll find that in the installation drop-down description. See so installation Windows 10 under line 6. There it is there. So just copy that. Put that into the directory. And just hit OK. Now be very careful with that because you see this auto rename menu just comes up right here and your mouse is right on top of that. I've accidentally clicked quite uh, twice in the past and uh, if you accidentally click auto rename uh, that's going to mess everything up you don't want to do that that's going to rename all the files and nothing's going to work your game will it's, it's just not going to work at all okay so just hit yes to all okay and when that's done that's it that's infantry 1.5 the core modification files installed so if you just wanted to install infantry 1.5 uh, say you've got a low spec system 
and uh, you just want to run it at the uh, basic performance of running with rifles just since just do that procedure I just showed you and infantry is installed now from now on uh, from now from this point onwards I'm going to show you how to install the high resolution textures so get out of this go here okay so in the article menu you'll see high res texture package click that click download Okay, so once it's downloaded, you want to go to your downloads menu, same procedure as before, 7-zip, open archive, media, extract. Okay, so paste the root directory in, so it's also here as well in the drop-down installation menu for the high-res texture package, copy, paste it in here, alternative method instead of using the mouse, just press enter once. Keep the mouse away from auto rename, just hit yes to war. And let the textures install. Uh, once this is installed, uh, we'll jump in game. I'll hop online, uh, show you that the mod can access the official invasion service. Uh, infantry was designed from the very beginning to access the official invasion service. So we'll show you that. Let's exit this. Okay, let's run uh, running with rifles. Okay, so join online game. Okay, so here we go, we're online. Right. So we're railroad gap. We're on the online official invasion server. It's been a while since I've actually played a full game on, online. I'm so busy uh, modding. That's it. show you guys how to um, uninstall the mod. Oh wait, got to save you. online. Okay, so let's uh, hop out of RWR and I'll show you how to uninstall the mod, how to revert back to a backup copy of Running Rifles, and then how to obtain the latest version of Running with Rifles. Okay, so let's get let's get start let's get into that. Okay, so properties, local files, browse local files. Okay, so the media folder, just delete it. Okay, so the mod's gone, that's it. The uh, media folder containing all the modifications is now gone. Right, so just go to your media backup folder. Let's rename that back to media. Now in Steam, in the local files of properties, hit verify integrity of game files. Okay, so Steam will check uh, 
the version of uh, you're running with rifles and all the files, make sure it's all validated. It's all validated, so it's all up to date. If it was not up to date, it would come down with a message here and say uh, 15, 20, 50 files do not validate. Steam is going to upload, uh, download those files, and it does it all automatically uh, in the download section. And uh, when that's done and download's complete, that's it. You're ready to play the game, and you've got your. Uh, original version of running rifles. Okay, and that's it. That's how you install infantry, uh, how to install high-res textures, how to uninstall the mod, and uh, how to revert back to the latest version of uh, running with rifles that's current. Okay, so that's it. And um, yeah, have fun with the mod. Uh, I'll see you out there. Uh, stay tuned to my YouTube channel. I will be uploading other videos uh, showcasing infantry. I want to get around to doing it. Been very busy with the mod so far. And um, yeah, see you out there. Maybe see you online. And uh, take it easy. Have fun. And I'll uh, see you then. Cheers.